Yo, what's up guys? This is Ray Mural here bringing you my first video for Minecraft. And this is me playing the be Minecraft Beta 1.8 pre-release and what I've built with all of my OP commands. When, what I'm showing you right now is my diamond block house with torches and doors everywhere. And, uh, here's my second floor, nothing built yet. And then my third floor. Now, I'm not entirely done. You never really are in Minecraft, in my opinion. Here's my little diving board off the second floor into the lake. Probably could have built that better somewhere else. And, um, yeah, just looking around. I built mine in fairly uh, middle area, like trees, flatland, mountains, water, stuff. And right now you're on my uh, auto wheat field just looking around right now on top of it I just recently planted all of this and now I will go inside and show you what I have done and you will see this on my 1.73 server and my single player <laughs> right there I was um, seeing what was wrong with my sword and apparently you can uh, now block so yeah, first of all, I can walk through the middle, and I also have a second entrance from the back, uh, instead of that door, where I'll be building more, because this is only like half done. I want to make it like complete, completely auto, like in the collection and stuff and whatever. And so basically what I do before I build all that is um, I go to the top here. I uh, follow all this, and um, I, I put the water in the hole, and it washes all the wheat away. If it's fully grown, then I get the wheat and a seed back. If it's not fully grown, I think I just get my seeds back. So, and then once I put all that down and it washes all the way to the end, I go down here to this little spot down the stairs, and right there at the end of the water is where I can collect it. Um, in a few minutes I will show in like an open version because this is closed on how I get it because it all washes down into there. And if enough people like this then I will show a tutorial. Oh and uh, one moment please. I'm sorry about that. Um, I had an issue. And here's uh, my 1.7.3 server. And right now, I, that's the inside of the little pyramid I made. And uh, because I had kind of a TNT accident. Yeah, that's really all I have right now. And um, I will show you the top of my pyramid where my actual house is. I don't play single player because I don't... I don't want to go looking for mods. I like having just the overpowered or OP commands where I type in the number and how many of it I want. Which you can clearly see by the diamond block house. <laughs> and this is the bottom of my house. I started from the top and built down. So I made it so monsters can't get in and hard for me to also get in. All four ways go the same way by the way. Just walk up my stairs and you can see that the other three directions I can get in I haven't really built anything this is just for me and my cousins and anyone else who feels like playing then right here is where the clouds pass through uh, apparently the clouds are supposed to be raised in 1.8 so I don't know yet and just a bunch of flaming pigs in a cage there's my third floor empty and then up here, I can see everything, and clearly everything hasn't loaded yet. And you can see to my left right there is a little safe base, which I will show you again later. And down there is my automatic open wheat field, which is my uh, like fifth one I made, but I'm only showing you, I think, three. Because my single player, no, I don't even know which one was my first one, to be honest. 
Oh, it's on uh, my cousin's server, my first one, so I can't show you. That's why. So, yeah, this is my open wheat field, and I, I dug out under it, so you can see under it. There's nothing there. I had to kill that. I tried blocking right here. It doesn't work. So this is the open version-ish. Just the water flows down. And I forgot a water, apparently. <laughs> Just put it back. So now I'm going to go to the top and show you what I see. And see how small it is? You just really put water at the top and it will flow down. I'm just showing you where it's flowing. And then it spreads out and goes all the way down because of some weird rule where it travels seven spaces but if it goes down it travels another seven or something like that eight I think and I you just saw my house from far away it's huge and here's my nether portal um something really stupid happened with my portal when I first uh like walked into it which uh you will see I just spun around for fun <laughs> What happened was, um, my portal was floating over nothing. Like, if I walk out, see, I'm good, whatever, yep. But you can see that I actually did have to plant stuff, and right here you can see my portal is, f like, above nothing. Just lava. So, when my cousins went through, they fell to their death <laughs> and lost everything. Pretty BS. And sorry for the length of this video. I'm just showing you what I do in Minecraft. And I think you're going to enjoy in about two minutes what I have to show you. But right now I'm showing you uh, how I got the one kilometer in um, Minecraft on a minecart. Put it there. Press the button. I don't have it. And it goes a kilometer, which is actually a thousand squares, which is kind of really fucking stupid. And as you can see, I'm showing you I'm overpowered by changing the time. I don't think I used my OP to get any items. I prefer multiplayer because I don't need the mods. And now, on a different side of my house, <coughs> just off the land, I have a giant bridge... Well, this is the small one into a safe shelter made of bedrock and obsidian, so I hope it doesn't break. This is where I'm going to go when I set off the, I guess, explosion. Yeah, that, that's the appropriate word. And I even built it under bedrock and obsidian. Like, it's really small, but it's actually a lot bigger than what you see on the inside. And for some reason, I built stairs to the top. So now I'm going to follow the, I guess, 150 bridge thing, I guess. <laughs> I don't know what to call it. 150 blocks. There we go. Which just so happens to be made out of diamonds. No glitches. And right now, if you're in full screen, you could probably tell what that is. It is my TNT Pyramid. I accidentally fell. Um, it is not on the ground, nor is it touching anything. TNT is touching TNT. Nothing else. So what I'm going to do first before going up there, or I mean before going to the top of my half-finished pyramid, I will climb the little tower that lets me see, like, it's taller than my TNT thing, so... I can actually see how I'm doing without going up there, but I think this is harder and kind of pointless. And for some reason, my cousin built a house right beside it. I don't know. As you can see right there, if you, if you really want to count it, I'll just tell you it's 64 by 64, bottom layer. And I'm not even, yeah, I'm not, I'm not even half done. That bull, I don't know. But that is, it, it's solid, 
And uh, I don't know why I did what I just did. I just put uh, water down. <laughs> uh, I thought it was going to be a safe way down. While I was going down, when I, once I reached the bottom, I realized, oh, crap. I, there's kind of a lake beside me that I could have jumped into and just a pointless waterfall. Right now I'm jumping up to the top and it's kind of an inside pyramid at the same time. My cousins work on the inside and I just build up. And we're eventually going to finish and I will make a video of me exploding this. <clears throat> Jeez, my voice. Ugh. So now right now I'm going to show you my single player, which is actually what I first started playing. Then I rage quit to my cousin's server and stuff. I have some sugar cane fields and a mini wheat field. And there's the other wheat field that I failed to make. This is a two-floored sugar field on top of my house. Sugar cane. I don't think it's sugar until you make it. And uh, I have uh, lava and waterfalls on top of my house. I don't know what I was thinking. I just thought it would be cool. Right here to my straight in front of me, I tried to make a railway track, but I couldn't figure it out. This was like a month ago. <laughs> and then I gave up and went to my multiplayer. And now I'm going inside my house, front door, yay. I have way too many furnaces and full chests. That uh, little mine thing there, that takes me uh, somewhere, which I will show you soon. Right here is my second floor, half built for the walls. And then I can go climb this ladder to my sugar cane field. Go down there to collect. And I just, if you don't know how to collect it, you just chop the top two and leave the bottom one so it grows back and here's the other side to collect just in case and also it comes down from the second floor <coughs> I was planning to make it really tall but I gave up and just went to multiplayer because it's a lot more fun for me and uh, right now I was trying to thinking like oh what am I supposed to show this is no island. I like I made my own island to build this house on. Um Yeah, I'm just walking around trying to figure stuff out what I'm supposed to be doing. I, I should have just skipped this, like I skipped the end to switch from servers. I don't know why I jumped. <laughs> but over there was my first house. Like first day I actually like started this game and I built this dirt bridge it's, I kind of sucked when I first started like everyone and over there goes to a mine shaft and that bridge right there goes to just fighting monsters that's where I go and then this is an island that was already here that I deleted everything and made flat and built walls around and left one thing open for my mining stuff where I plant all my trees. And now right here, <coughs> that tunnel I'm looking at goes to my house, which was from before inside my house. And if you go the other way, I'll show you in a second. This is also another mining area if I go anywhere else except those two tunnels. Over here it comes up to where I used to have a mine cart, but I didn't know how to work it at the time which would follow that cobblestone path over to where I can get lava and a second uh, just mining area. Oh, and that's another bridge to where I can go fight monsters. But anyways, guys, that is my Minecraft. This is what I used to play. I don't play single player anymore. If I'm playing, I'm on my multiplayer server or my cousin's server. Because I like having the OP commands. Just makes the game a lot more fun for me. Or funner. <laughs> Anyways, if you guys want to see that giant ass TNT explosion, feel free to subscribe. 
And also subscribe if you like Call of Duty Black Ops or Call of Duty in general, Gears of War, Assassin's Creed, and Halo. I do play a variety of other games, but those are my main games. Peace out, guys. And yeah.